We are troubleshooting an Arians snowblower. In this case, it's the Deluxe 28 model. It was brought in, uh, is being used, and then all of a sudden, the dry stopped working. The auger spins, everything like that. Uh, the customer pulled off the cover, and what he found was this spring to sitting up in here and broken. And if we get in here, I may have to come around, see the best way to show you. You can see right here, uh, get in there camera. This bar is not sitting in that hole anymore. Uh, the belt looks to be good. And, you know, it's kind of sitting out here a little wonky because it's not sitting where it should over there. But we're going to flip this thing up and open the pan and see if we find the other part of that spring and what else might be broken and figure out what parts we need to fix it. I can see there's a lot of belt debris in here. And... Uh, Here's the other side of the spring. All right, so upon investigating a little bit more, this piece that's right at the end here is broken because here is the other piece of it. So somehow this piece failed, causing that whole arm to come out of where it should be, which I'm pretty sure caused the spring to bust. So. We need to get probably just a new spring in this piece and then put it back together and see what happens. New parts are here. I got the spring and I got these two pieces that hold that drive in place. And looking at it, the drive really doesn't have any wiggle room. So I'm guessing the front of this thing has got to come off because you're going to have to swing the arm out for the, the drive and then get it out and then put the new piece on and put it back in there. All right, so right down here is the cable that holds on to the plate that goes to the handle. So you gotta remove the clip on there and the spring. And as soon as you do, that gives you enough room to shimmy it over. So now we can take the old part off. Put the new part on and then just slide it right back in. And we'll just let it sit like that. And we just got to get the cable back on. You got a washer. And then you got a retaining clip. You kind of got everything there. Get one bolt started. Get the other bolt started on this side.
And before I put the new piece on, I'm just going to put some grease on here. Just give it a little bit of extra lubrication. It doesn't move much. But you don't want that metal on metal grinding over the years. All right, next we gotta hook the spring up. So it's just right on the pulley. There's two nuts there, it goes right in between. And it just comes straight across. And there's a spot on the, the frame for that spring. So now, so now there's tension on the belt and it'll spin the disc and we'll move the machine. Make sure that we might have to adjust the cable for the drive since everything broke. Might've been out of whack for a bit. So we're gonna have to check that out too.